I have Gretchen Hanstein hanging out in the studio with me. She is the Jerome FFA president, and it is FFA week, and you guys are going to love this. We got some, okay, I'll tease, goat kissing. That's all I'm going to say. I'll let uh, Gretchen fill us in. So so first off, um, you know, tell me a little bit about FFA week. I mean, what, what do we have to expect here? Well, FFA Week is actually celebrated across the nation. Okay. So local chapters, districts, state associations go out and they promote agriculture and agricultural education and just getting out there in the community and helping people out and just promoting ourselves and showing what we're made of. Cool. And we are in the Magic Valley. I mean, FFA is probably huge. What's happening this week? What kind of events are going on? Well, we have dress-up days at some of the schools that don't have finals this week. And then they're doing, like, drive your tractor to school day. They have donkey basketball again Friday night for Kimberly. And the best thing, I think, is the Kiss the Animal contests that are coming up. Right. So, all right, break this down for me. How does that work? So what happens in Jerome is we make jars for each of the teachers that get nominated, and then kids can put money in them, and whichever teacher at the end of the week has the most money has to kiss a goat. Like, this isn't a metaphor for something. Liter- literally, kiss a goat. Yes, kiss a goat on the mouth. <laughs> <laughs> um, wow, whoever thought of this was genius. Um, this is perfect. Everyone either had that teacher that they would legitimately pay money to see, kiss a farm animal, um, or just a, f- a funny teacher that you would just love to to see ham it up and, and kiss a goat. Oh, so so what's the money? The money's raised for FFA, I assume, right? Yeah, the money this year will actually go back towards our national land judging team that's going to Oklahoma in May. Awesome. Okay, so great cause, but really uh, the payoff is the best. Is Is there a teacher that you think should be nominated? Well, that you want to say publicly, <laughs> I'm just going to say that there's one teacher that I think it'll be hilarious if he has to do it. And okay. then our principal also got nominated. So I have a feeling it's going to be between those two as to who has to kiss the goat Friday during lunch. Oh, that is genius. And y- you told me a pretty interesting fact when it comes to kissing a farm animal. Uh, evidently, the goat is the cleanest. Yeah. So if you have to choose... <laughs> From a horse, cow, pig, sheep, or goat, mm-hmm. the goat will be the cleanest. <laughs> okay, I just learned something. But uh, are you gonna is are you gonna like you know wet wipe the face, the, the lips of the goat? What's what's happening here? We're gonna take poop and we're gonna no, put you're it not. On the mouth. Yes. Oh my goodness! That is the best part about it is we make sure that it is as gross as it can be. <laughs> But it's the cleanest animal, so... Um, <clears throat> It'll be like, make it dirty really fast, have them kiss it, oh! and then the goat's going to want us to clean it up. Oh, my... This is probably the coolest thing I've ever heard. Um, so please, Jerome, represent and nominate and just raise a lot of money because uh, you're better. <laughs> oh, my goodness. So if people want to find out more and uh, join FFA, which is, I should mention, Future Farmers of America, right? Yeah, that's what it used to stand for. Okay, so what does it... Oh, perfect. What does it stand for now? So now it's just the National... National FFA organization because in 1988 they decided that it was no longer just agriculture it was something bigger where they're trying to get kids ready to be able to public speak and be able to do leadership opportunities and grow as people to make a positive impact in our world. Awesome. Wow, I learned like so much during this interview. Um, So if people do want to find out more about FFA, what's the best route to do that? You can either talk to your local high school and get in contact with their chapter, or you can go to FFA.org. A lot of the pictures from this week are on Instagram at National FFA, uh, Jerome FFA, and just different chapters, hashtag FFA week. Will the goat kissing picture be there it should be okay we'll be following that for sure (laughs) Uh, we're gonna put all this info online um please go support because the goat kissing uh thing is 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 awesome i'm can i donate some money like sure i mean okay we'll we'll talk when we're done i think i got a couple of bucks on me all right uh 983thesnake.com you can find out all this info